Hello everybody and welcome back to the And More Bus Videos YouTube channel. I'm And More Bus Videos, otherwise known as And More Central, depending on what day of the week it is and what video you are watching. And welcome back to something that we haven't done in a while. I believe this is um, Project BG. It's, it's um, let's have an actual proper look at the map name. Um, because we, we, I, I roughly, vaguely know what the name is, but there we go. It's Tuasan 1 West Beta 2. Um, it's a map that I've had installed for a fair bit. I've driven it a lot before. It's basically the 34M map. Um, and I thought it has been a while, so I thought there's no harm in us having a little bit of a drive on the map. And once again, there we go, um, with this lovely vehicle, the Dennis Dart. So we did quite a lot back in the day, for those of you that have been around watching the Anmar Central channel for quite a few years. Many, many years ago, I used to um, be quite focused on the Hong Kong um, bus world um, because as sort of OMSI 2 developed, it was very, very apparent that um, the Hong Kong bus community um, were sort of um, arguably one of the most developed um, communities within... There we go. I thought you didn't start properly. There we go. William. So we'll get the bus on to stand as the AI, I believe, can be a little bit strange on this one. So I'd rather get everybody on uh, before the AI tries to take all our people. Hello. But yes, it's been a while since I've driven um, on Hello. this map. It's just quite nice to be back, in all honesty. Um, it's something a bit different, as, as per. Try and get a couple more people. No, no more people. Okay. Um, but it's quite nice to be back on this map. Um, as I say, the Hong Kong community have always been a little bit um, more developed in the OMSI world um, since sort of the growth of OMSI 2. Um, it was very, very apparent um, that they sort of, with the skills of converting... Oh, more people? Okay. Um, with the skills of converting um, more infrastructure from other, map, from other maps, other games, like they believe this is very MM2-y based, um, it basically allowed them to develop um, their infrastructure a lot quicker than most other people and most other uh, maps and things. Although now other communities have caught up, the UK community and things is on par, if not in some essences, um, the top community now um, for map and vehicle developments. Um, it's still quite nice to have a little drive on one of these maps and it'll also be quite interesting to see how much of this I remember. So the bus that we are driving is the Dennis Start PP Beta um, that should give a hint that it's, I don't believe it's available um, at the moment. I, I got it when it was available um, a while back, but I don't believe it's available at this exact moment. And we're driving in the Oreo advert, because I thought, well, why not? Uh, something a bit different. So, and everybody's screaming at me in German. So I thought we'd have a little drive of this. I mean, it's not a perfect bus. We have absolutely no blinds on, but in the nicest way, if you're used to getting um, small, small oldish buses on your local 34M service, and this would be nothing from the norm, um, if I'm entirely honest. So I know I've taken deckers on this before, but I never really see the need um, when all the other buses are single decks. I mean, sometimes it can get it can get quite busy, um, but even then, um, I prefer taking something like this because most of the vehicles have been done in passenger paths and capacity to be full and standing to the door as that's kind of what they do um, in Hong Kong in real life. There we go, let's get the people on. Hello. Well, let's also see how much of this route I actually remember, because this is going to be quite fun. I know I believe it's a very, very basic loop because it's quite a lot more of the map that's been put in or converted or whatever you want to refer to it as. Uh, but there's a massive bus station that we just do not serve. So, um, 
If I remember correctly, we'll go down and do a loop and come back, and that's that's pretty much what we will do um, for this video. It's not the fastest of us as this dart, but it's something a bit different. I mean, I remember these darts with this style of bodywork back in the day with First West Yorkshire in Halifax. Um, I remember, I think I went on one um, when First Halifax used to have a nice array of Dennis darts. So I'll have to dig out those photos, and I've definitely got them in the archive somewhere, so they will have to, have to dig them out. Everybody just walking through the curtain. <laughs> in all honesty, when I stopped, Hello. I was I didn't really clock that. But yeah, we can prove that everybody's superhuman. Uh, oops. Hello. I think I'm going to end up eating my words, aren't I, on this route? We're going to leave people behind. Uh, no, it's quite. It, I do miss driving these incredibly stupidly busy bus routes. Um, they they are quite they are quite cool to drive. Hello. 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 <laughs> there we go. The German, the German um, speaking part of Hong Kong. Gosh, it is a little bit in, little bit in limp mode is this bus. It does not like having a bit, having a full capacity bus. That is, that is very safe to say. <laughs> Although I do always remember these darts never particularly being the fastest of vehicles, although I always had a soft spot for them, they were never never particularly quick motors. And then again, there's a bus station up there that we just don't serve. But now I just cannot get any power up on this. <laughs> this is a this is Dennis Dart in mode, is this? This is not this is not what I signed up to drive. Not what I signed up to drive at all. Hello. Well in fairness, I did pick the Dennis Dart, so I Kind of hello. should have known what I was signing up for. Hey, hello. hello. These things happen. Oh, Yeah, it's certainly getting slower, is this? Certainly getting slower. As I say, I don't think a, a full capacity loading was particular help there, our magical Oreo bus, but <laughs> it's it, It's safe to say that it's definitely not, not um, getting along with me at the moment. Um, the Oreo Express, the Oreo Limp Mode Express. That's what we're driving. It's just every time I have to stop, it just very painful to start up again. There we go, bus stopping things being taken off. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not quick, is this? Definitely not, not. Not as quick as I remember it. Oh, we actually fall. 
Oh. Okay. <laughs> That didn't take as long as I thought it would. We're actually full. No wonder the bus is struggling. I the fuck would have got a few more standing passengers. So now we're at Motor, I mean, highly realistic to uh, how slow, how slow these, um, these darts can be. Um, highly realistic. And the sounds are nice as well. No, no, I don't mind. I don't mind the livery either. I think the livery's pretty cool. Some, something a bit different, so to speak. Oh, we're actually early. Okay. I don't know quite how we've managed that. I'm hoping that the bus is getting off here because otherwise. Oh, lovely. Yeah, they're not all getting on this. Uh, two people have got off. Uh, two and all of these people are waiting here, but it's this one guy that's from the other side of the stop that's been chosen as the one that's getting on. Hello, we are now full. Let, let's continue. I thought, in fairness, though, if it had been mapped correctly, the entire bus should have really got off at the station. If the entire bus got off at the station and then everybody else got on, then that would kind of make sense, but obviously it hasn't been set up like that. So most of the people, in fairness, are just going to do a massive ride round on the loop. I don't mind, but for, for the sake of realism. <laughs> Although, in fairness, the enthusiast, the enthusiast grouping um, for um, the, the West... Not the West Mids. Um, in Hong Kong. Um, I don't know, I'm thinking West Midlands. Um, Hong Kong um, is, is quite big. They have quite a, a, quite a large sum of enthusiasts there. So it wouldn't be from the norm if this entire bus, when it rocked up, was just full of enthusiasts doing a round trip. There's no point in even de de accelerating when you go around because it's just it's just not going to make any difference. Well, oh, ambulance. That is some that is some epic echo. Oh, we're going, we're going. Come on, come on, boss, come on, boss. You can do this. There's no one getting off. I can't stop. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm full. <laughs> oh, we're going. I don't know why everybody started breaking then. Because that means it takes me ages to get back up to power again. But yes, then it's that in limp mode. What a video. <laughs>
least the cab on this is partially functional. I mean, and you can move the steering wheel. And the accelerators and brakes function. And I, I mean, you can't... You can't mess with this, and you can't unfortunately set up your announcements yet. But, in fairness, I feel like that's a bonus, as I don't want to particularly and be drowned out by announcements in limp mode and just announcements blaring out all the time. This is not a good combination. Goodness me, Toyota. Look, even though even though it's stuttered when setting off, it still left us. <laughs> We've got caught by the lights as a result. Yeah, this this bus is this bus and a full capacity load really really do not mix. Uh, goodness me, <laughs> really do not mix. also advertising strawberry cream Oreos that just sound awesome. <laughs> so, I've all just looked at the liveries and thought, well, we, we've, dri we've driven this Rick KMB livery before, and I thought, well, the advert looks cool. And it's something a bit different. And in turn, something to distract us from limp mode. <laughs> Sorry, bus full. Oh, bye, bus. <laughs> Mini bus just just disappeared into the abyss. AI that hasn't wanted to load in properly. Not even in the mirror. Well, walk on the roof, okay. Crack on. Even if you try and drop it down a gate, it just makes no difference. The iconic, iconic um, Dennis Dart Idol sound. Gotta love it. Come on, boss, you can do it.
I'm not sure which one will go up, but I'm going up the second one. Uh, I presume we're supposed to go up that one, but it doesn't matter, we'll go up the second one. Yeah, definitely was supposed to be the first one. Well, no, I say that. I mean, I recognise this top of this junction, so... No, it might actually be this one. Oh, no, I don't know. A lot of ways, nobody wanted to get off. There was nobody wanting to get on, and... This gets us back to back to the station a little bit quicker. Yeah, it just does not sound happy. Come on, steering lock. It was a little bit of an end. Apparently we were too early, so if we can end up too early in this, then the timetable is very, very slack. <laughs> very slack indeed. But anyway, that was an interesting run. Um, that was a limp mode run um, with the whole Hong Kong Dennis Dart, the little floor one, um, on Tio San Juan um, map. Um, a, ni a nice map. Um, I, I don't mind it. It's nice as a as sort of to lap round, but arguably not nice when you're going to bus in limp mode, although what map is nice um, with a bus like that. Um, for now, though, I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, then do be sure to click that like button so that more people can find it and enjoy like you have. And if you haven't already, do be sure to subscribe to the Add More Bus Videos YouTube channel for more content like this from the simulation section, as well as an archive of over 5,000 backseat and engine-focused public transport videos from around the UK and beyond. With buses, trams, trains and more, there's something on this channel for everyone um, in the archives with an additional 21 videos um, posted per week for those archives alongside the simulation section so do make sure you subscribe to the channel and check out those archives if you haven't already once again though i would like to thank you all for watching i really hope you've enjoyed this one and i will see you all in the next video mate goodbye for now bye